Greetings, Keishlings. Keish Prime here with my live reaction of My Hero Academia, Chapter 429. Alright. The end is near. A.K.A. like a week. So, this is the second to last chapter, as far as I know, unless we go on break. So, yeah. Uh, hmm. I was expecting it to go to the end of summer. Expect and expectations uh, be damned apparently but uh, let's get to it shall we alrighty so August 2nd and also there's going to be the new movie so that should be fun that might actually be the last movie so nice color cover it's simple but works Oh, this double color spread. Oh, it's... They're actually showing her in... I guess now they can. Because she, like, evolved her cork or whatever. Well, I forget how she became visible. Um, Love that hair. Like, wasn't expecting that at all. But yeah, they're all just kind of... I mean, out of you... Nobody cares. I'm glad half of you is covered up by the ten. Has it been ten years since the series? Is that what we're going with the whole thing? I'm I'm very confused. <clears throat> but uh, after we found out that my quirk is a variation that doesn't come from anyone in the family. Daddy, mommy, sister, uncle, auntie, grandpa, granny, and great granny stopped being nice to me. What a boy's monologue. But then, they tied me up and locked me in the basement. Oh, crap. Who is this? I was sad and scared, so I cried and screamed, which made them sew my mouth so it wouldn't open that much. I am here is the title, so I'm guessing All Might found out and saved someone? I don't know how many years passed since that day but then they all started saying this country is doomed they only gave me as much water and sweets as they could carry and then I never saw them again oh so you were locked in the basement after the when everything went down during the the big end war some time passed and a big impact opened some cracks in the basement letting me leave the house. It had been so long that the sunlight made my skin hurt. It was scary. I wondered why I couldn't leave. Why it saddened me so much. Who are you? This seems so random. <clears throat> also, we got some volunteers bringing green tea to the workers. All this time, I felt scared and sad. So, why is it that other people... Oh God! The, you did you rip those off of your face? That had to be very painful. Are you, are smiling like that? <coughs> Why does he look like L from Death Note? <laughs> um, I've always loved seeing people happy. I feel like that's not what you've ever seen. That's why I wanted to become a hero, but Ochako Chan, it would have been okay for a hero to do those things. Okay, so now we're. What the fuck is going on? Um, but you were concerned about me, even though you didn't need to be. I am alive at the expense of Himiko Chan's life what what I did so now we're t who was the kid in the basement um it obviously wasn't Himiko so what I'm very confused um Uraka-san so here he is rushing over to her she's like <laughs> what why are you here how I just had a gut feeling, so I jumped all the way up here using one frog. See, he still has it. 
He's just got embers, so that could last for a really long time. After all, this is the place where we had our important talk. Oh, yeah. That's not what I mean. I said I'd be going home, didn't I? You did, and it'd been fine if that was really the case, but I had a feeling you were here. Why? I don't want to be singing. Sorry, but I want to show you. We get in confession? <laughs> because that's how it's always been when it comes to you, Arakasan. Why can't you call her Ochaku? Right. Um, ever since the entrance exam. It's my quirk. Sorry for stopping you, but yeah, when she caught him midair. Well, it's a bad omen to trip and fall. Remember the point system? Can you give him some of the points I earned? Aw. You, you've always been like that. But Deku, well, it just screams, do your best. I kind of like it. <laughs> uh, you've always prioritized others over yourself. I mean, she kind of has. Let's be honest. What she's done to try and make her family have an easier life. Mm, excuse me. <clears throat> is kind of heartbreaking in itself. Even during the sports festival. Always. Always. She just continues to cry. Deku kun, you, you gotta calm down. Ah, I believe that's when, uh. The, uh. When his, uh, black whip were coming out, right? been a while I can't remember all these things as clearly as I once did I've always uh, I'm always getting saved by you this place is my hero acad <laughs> academy let him I almost said academia uh, let him stay here you are my hero Aww. that's why I don't want to depend on your strength forever holding someone's hand can put your heart at ease Aww, and he's trying to <clears throat> He's holding her hand. She's just crying. Himiko Chan, when heroes suffer, died because of me. Honey, she was going to die from something. Probably a gunshot had she escaped. Because, <laughs> um, I mean, she would have gone for blood eventually. Someone would have killed her. So, at least you were someone that actually cared about her. <clears throat> so, I wouldn't feel any blame. If I hadn't been stabbed, if I didn't have all those unnecessary thoughts, her cork allowed her to share her blood with anyone. Even if that wasn't how she looked, wasn't there another way to find her sooner? If only had I realized sooner... If I met her when we were kids, would things have been different? Who will be there to protect the heroes? I've also been having these same thoughts about Tenko, about Tomura Shigaraki. Now that the battle's over, things just don't go back to how they were before. All for one told me that the path I chose is a thorny one. But even so... If we uh, keep reaching out our hands, even when it's none of our business, then I'm sure that... Wait. Everyone's showing up? Okay. Oh. Uh, they're here. Uraka. We're here too. Stupid ochaka chan <laughs> I was waiting for you to open up to me. You can always tell me what you're feeling. Oh, she just like leaps at her. I love it the embers you jumped all the way here right are the embers doing fine yeah what embers does that mean wait so they don't know okay why didn't you tell us even I was there he's to my god he's actually looking rested for once like the bags under his eye like damn they're like gone that man's gotten some sleep. Um, I mean, after everything that's happened, he, he deserves it. I mean, you don't lose an, or a leg 
half of the effectiveness of your cork and you don't get to rest <laughs> um, but anyway one for all was completed oh sorry my dad's mowing the grass a power brought together by the bravery of many wait they erected more statues what <laughs> or no well they're not new they're new statues but they're not where I thought they were they weren't near the All Might one. Um, they're at the school, so... Oh my god. I forget his name. It's like Mona... Mona me? Something like that? The, the copycat guy. He actually got one for what he, you know, put into play. <clears throat> Eerie Chan's getting to sing! Also, is her court... Is the horn growing back? I think it is, so... Everyone was kind of worried about, like, it being broken off. It's like, she broke it off. Horns grow back. And, I mean, hers grows and shrinks unnaturally anyway. So, I don't know what people were worried about. Aw, Aoyama. Is he getting, like, a little party while in prison or whatever? Aoyama's farewell party. Ah, ah yes, because he's leaving the academy. Okay. I was like, wait, I forgot. It was it prison or something else? <laughs> oh, God, I'm stupid. Now, if we could all create something of our own. Oh, look at here. He's just going like, <laughs> uh, You want to expand the chart? Yeah, but just a part of it. I think we'll have to wait until the restoration reaches a certain point, though. The chart? So, the hero chart? <clears throat> it's just that many non-heroes played a big role during the war. We'll search, uh, or we'll select some people to be considered heroic figures instead of the heroes we already have. Okay. Wait, why the hell does All Might look like that now? That's interesting. He kind of looks like he's shifting in between his two forms right now. That's kind of weird. Um, but he's talking to Hawks. Makes sense. Hawks has got, you know, that prestige now. He could probably do that. I was leaning towards abolishing the popularity aspect of it. On a merit demerit system, the focus will always be on demerits but I want to update it without letting go of the positives. Hmm. Even the greatest can't be anywhere every time, and if we're trying to save as many people as possible, our current model is not the answer. What is up with All Might's face? <clears throat> so, we can uh, have many great heroes, or many greatest heroes. Yeah. Okay, so there's the basement dweller um why oh that woman's pregnant um am I the only one to wait what is his blood is like sunny wait it's like his body's dissolving into freaking blood and also his face is deformed now even more so than it was a second ago this old lady like grabbed his hand I wonder if that kid was saved by a hero after I left. Wait, is this his granny? It still keeps me awake at night. That day, Izuku Midoriya showed up something. Wait, why do you have a needle? Uh, instead of just rooting for him, we felt the need to do something. That's what people felt that day, and this feeling will get in, will just get stronger. <clears throat> so it's fine now, because granny is here. Also, his face just looks almost completely fixed. <laughs> hey, what are you two doing? <laughs> so now, a society where heroes have time to spare. Eventually, the wind, initiated by Deku and his friends, will... Next issue, last chapter. End a poster cover, or color page. Okay, so it is confirmed. It doesn't seem to be on break, but what was the whole point of Mr. Basement Man? Like, that didn't seem to... That came out of nowhere. It was nice. It, 
Also, <clears throat> why is it Granny? Like, the fact that it's Granny is not a good thing in the long run because the lady going to die. Probably in the next ten years, this kid's just going to be alone again. It's like, unless his life has been built up and, like, we didn't even know what the hell his cork was. Like, he kind of just melts into blood, it kind of looks like. I, what? Don't leave us on, you know, certain points without giving us information to make us feel like, ah, yes, I understand why you're including this. Now, be it, it could just be the whole thing of, like, how society's changing, how we're healing, all that kind of stuff. That would have been fine. But maybe explain why he was so hated to the point where they locked him in the basement, sewed his mouth shut, and then abandoned his ass when the world went to shit. Like, don't bring this up if you're never going to give us the whole story. A little more information would have been fine. Especially in the penultimate chapter. Makes no sense to me. Also, we didn't even get a confession, so... Neither one of them still knows if they love each other or not, so... The fandom will continue. Um... <clears throat> now... It's good that Oshaku got those feelings out and everything. So, I think she's now at a point where she can finally heal... <clears throat> like everybody in the class is probably now aware of it <coughs> mm, excuse me so you know a strong support system uh, people that played a big role are now being commemorated for their um, their acts during the final war <coughs> Monoma I'm a little surprised got it <coughs> in the form of a statue at the school, but hey, awesome for him. Everyone hates his guts. He's got a cool power. I always like copycat abilities and stuff, but depends on how they're used to if they're good or not. But, you know, but yeah, like his trickster personality is more advantageous, I guess, to that power, so. Uh, <clears throat> while I'm not super drawn to him as a character, it's still interesting. So, I like that he got some praise. Um, just, they're going to reevaluate the hero charts. Okay, that's cool. Like that. Include the people who actually help. Mm, excuse me that are still heroes. I mean, heroes are everyday people, you know. The, the like, kind of uh, old saying that, you know, pops up every now and again where it's like, not all heroes wear capes kind of thing. It's like, yeah, the, yeah, let's live up to that. Um, <clears throat> you know, not everyone's going to have some superpower. And, I mean, look at Batman. Man just buys a bunch of toys. It's like, but he's still a superhero. But you don't even need to do that. It's just like, bam. It's like, hey, you help save someone, boom. Let, let that knowledge be known and let them be, you know, somewhat praised for it. Like, that's great. I like that. <clears throat> um, the embers wondering how long they're going to last i mean the fact that bakugo actually asked it's like you you jumped up here are the embers okay i mean deku could have easily lied i mean we don't even know exactly how powerful those embers are how long they're going to last will he kind of adapt like with all might <clears throat> uh or an, adopt all might's like style of like heroism where when the need arises he'll use them but otherwise he won't so he won't use them willy nilly but and then he'll continue to reinforce you know his ideals of just help for help's sake you know like and then that's just gonna heal society and make it stronger so so even when he doesn't have them anymore, he can still play an ever-pivotal role. 
as the greatest hero. So, <coughs> I mean, All Might himself, who at this point should very well be dead. I mean, given what we knew from the very beginning of the story. And as it developed with more information, it's like he could stand alongside Deku and just... It's like the two pillars of absolute heroism trying to make society better. If that's how the series ends, hey, go for it. Love it. So, <clears throat> but uh, yeah, I've rambled on long enough. Um, let me know your own thoughts and opinions. Anything I missed, misunderstood, please let me know down below. Check out my other content all that good stuff links down below for my socials part of the one punch man podcast all that good stuff it's on grim reaper's channel um and uh as always later days until next time quichelings we head to the final chapter in one week's time how will it all end will it end well will it end crap will i react to it damn skippy i will Let's go.